This afternoon we have presented a study in the annual SRE meeting held in Vienna, including almost 1,200 patients undergoing HRT cycles uh, for embryo transfer. And we have measured serum progesterone levels the day uh, of embryo transfer and detected that those patients having uh, serum progesterone below a certain threshold, in this case 8.8 .8 nanograms per ml, had a significantly lower ongoing pregnancy rate. In fact, we saw that the decrease was 18% uh, in ongoing pregnancy rate. This is very relevant, and one of the, uh, the, the reasons uh, that made this uh, study so important is that until now it was thought that measuring serum progesterone levels the day of embryo transfer was not predictive because it was not uh, reflecting its effect in the uterus, but after conducting two prospective studies in our center, we can say that it is reflecting the effect in the uterus because we have related clinically the uh, serum progesterone with the ongoing pregnancy rates. So now we are, have started measuring progesterone to all our patients undergoing HRT cycles and we have started some lines of research just to see how can we individualize the luteal phase support in order to improve the prognosis in all our patients.